Hey folks, uh, welcome to Daddy West to dinner. Just came home from church and we are famished. We are looking for something to eat. So let's see what's available in the fridge. Let's go. When you want to cook up something healthy um, because you do not want to go for the regular instant noodle, what can we have at home? Uh, if you have potato, if you have onion, and if you have doenjang, which is the Korean bean paste, you can cook up a simple Korean bean paste stew for yourself as well as your family and children. Let's see what uh, we have uh, in the fridge that we can put into this bean paste stew. Yeah, I'm looking for potato and onion and we always have, have some of them here so I have potato I'm cooking for four so I will just pick up two potatoes and one large onion okay, that will be enough two potatoes and one large onion and uh, let's see what we have in the fridge of course you would need some um, bean paste, doenjang this is the one this is the one that's not um, seasoned uh, we have another kind which is with, uh, with seafood prawn flavour and anchovy clam flavour we're not going to do that because I realise I have some clams in my fridge so I'll cook fresh clam with this bean paste uh, besides these things, it will always be nice to have tofu. Um, I don't use the silken tofu, but I use the pressed tofu that is slightly firmer and uh, it's more suitable for this stew. You need some vegetables. Let's see what do we have. Um, just, I just bought a chuchini. It's very suitable for this bean paste stew and some spring onions uh, just as garnish let's come over and take a look at all the ingredients so we have a potato onion and the bean paste these are the staple no you need you need all of them for the bean paste stew um, and tofu i would say it's very important too because but well, just feel incomplete without tofu uh, seafood, any kind of seafood and some vegetables it can be any kind of vegetables as well okay uh, let's start let's start preparing the stew uh, it can be ready in 15 minutes if you know what to do As you can see, all the ingredients are ready. We shall now cook the bean paste stew. Uh, recently, I just bought a Korean Korean clay pot. This is the one, right? Uh, we're going to try cooking using the Korean clay pot. But since I'm cooking for four, this will definitely not be enough. This is like a two-man's portion. I will cook with a regular steel pot as well. So I'll just cook. Uh, two portions here and two portions here. Let's see how it can be done. How it is to be done. Let's put the initial ingredients in the pot first. 
Um, the initial ingredients are potato. Okay, I'll put half a portion of potato here and the other half portion here. Onion as well. Onion, half portion. And the other half portion here. Okay, fill them with water and we'll bring them to a boil. use this amount of water for now and uh, later if I need more I will just add on the good thing about the clay pot is this the clay pot keeps the heat so later when we serve the food in the clay pot the, the stew continue to remain hot while we are still eating and I love my soup hot when it's cold uh, it doesn't feel good anymore. So let's wait a while for the for the stew to come to a full boil. As the water is boiling. The, the next thing we need to do is to just scoop in one big block of this doin jang into the soup. One big block, let it cook. Um, at this stage, you can add your vegetables. Let's add the vegetables. Half of them here, and the other half on this side. It's like uh, almost overflowing. I'll bring some over here. Yeah. Don't you think this is much better than, than buying food from outside uh, or cooking a Maggi, uh, uh, an instant noodle? Right, this is much healthier. I've read out about this uh, doin jang because it's fermented food. It's very healthy as well. So next time when you need a quick lunch or quick dinner, and do not know what to do, prepare this. It's been 10 minutes and we will go to the last stage of our cooking. Our clams and tofu is to be added at this stage. Clams should not be overcooked, that's why I'll add them last. Need to leave them in the soup until they open, and the moment all the clams open up, is when the soup is ready. I think it should take less than five minutes. And I'll pour my tofu in as well. Put it up and let them come to a boil. Okay, see you in five minutes. Five minutes up. As you can see, all our clams are open. Let's not overcook this. Uh, they, they are the best at this stage when they just open, when the clams just open. All right, I'll switch off the fire and I'll add some condiments and we will be ready to serve. I would like to just add a dash of uh, sesame oil and then sprinkle my spring onions over it. As you can see, now take a look at these two pots. I've switched off the fire but the, the pot with uh, the clay pot continue to boil because it, it keeps the heat so well. Well, this steel pot, regular steel pot, stop boiling. Okay, great. We can now serve our bean paste stew. I need my children to come to help carry the stew out. Um, 
Can someone come and help carry the stew out? Hi. Okay, uh, you have to hold at these two sides because this is super hot. And some hot pepper. Take a look at this one. This I think everyone wants to eat from this this pot because it looks so appetizing on this Korean clay pot. It's the right it's the right container to cook the soup. Okay, come together everyone and we will pray before we eat. Let's pray. Dear God, thank you for a wonderful morning, uh, having fellowship with our church friends. And uh, now we are, we are home and you have provided us with good food as well. We want to thank you, con uh, refresh us and help us to continue to serve you and serve the people around us. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Okay, let's try. Take a spoon and let's try. Okay, look at this full pot of of yummy and nutritious stuff we have potato the potato is just boiled just nice mm. nice and soft let me try the chuchini and the tofu I have them together mm. Soft and it has uh, absorbed all the all the flavor of the stew. Tofu no, is no, really good. really hot. Really <laughs> hot. And uh, I'll have one clam. Ooh, that's the clam. That's the clam. With lots of garnish on it. Hmm. Hmm. You should try this one day. Thank you for watching and our channel is called Daddy West to Dinner Yeah, don't forget to subscribe Bye